Watch this! Valir versus Jaina! You ask for it. Watch your back. Alright, we drew the card. That one, not this one. Do you run favors? Uh, no, I don't run favor. I think just a higher top end is preferable. Uh, next turn is like pirate, cold blood, uh, hero power. Not sure which pirate yet. Uh, it's something I'm testing out. I saw Meowth do it yesterday, and I. It seems, seems like a good thing to do. I could actually go double one. Uh, the reason being is that gives me a better probability of landing a Bunglemancer next turn. Five is not typically a. Um, An AoE turn. Do I want to play the Cold Blood? Yes. Here we go. I didn't see a better use for the coin in that uh, position, so. Why not cut patches for Skater Box? At least he has Rush. Good point. I cannot clear that. What about swapping out Barnes and Big Priest for two Witchwood Grizzlies? Um, you wanna cast a I would not recommend that. Uh, Barnes is just a free win a lot of the time. Am I going to have to get through another ice block? Three ice blocks? That would, uh, that would not be, that would not be fun. You can't swap one for two. <laughs> yeah, that would give you some problems. Wait, that was the babbling book card. Did I miss something? Five, eight, I'm a little bit off. If I had to go that route. I think it's important to pop them at uh, at one and not three. What about Witchwood Piper and Big Priest? I, I know some people are doing it, but. Um, I don't, I just, Reality. I don't know if it's worth it. Okay, the Skulker's looking pretty good. Um, just to block him from gaining more armor here. And then, like, I can't leave that up for another turn, so the boom just has to wait. The boom might not even be necessary if he can't clear this. I don't think you need to do anything, like, cute in Big Priest. You just need to play Big Priest and win. 
Uh, we don't have any lethal oil draws. So, we'll just play the big thing, hit him in the head, and uh, press the button. Is this a Hail Mary turn? You can't even play the... Uh... Oh good, we gave this guy another free win. Get the coin fungal man as an option. Here we go. Here we go. Five drop I'd play over. Uh, we just need to keep pushing damage. Probably actually using this so I can get the uh, cold blood on the horse rider as an option. Uh, hold some burn. There's the brawl. Just as long as it's not one of the two attack guys. Good, not great. Go here, here, here. It's a bit of a shame for playing the weapon, though. Or for swinging with the weapon. Don't worry, love. The cavalry's here. Here we go. Out of my yep. We dagger SI that down and uh, re dagger. Could also play the Skulker and push some extra damage. That seems better. What lurks in the depths? Here we go. Uh, we put it here because Flurry is a card that we want to play around. I'll show the, ooh, like Shield Slam. Uh, order lol. So it's uh, seven nine. Yeah, we get him. Feed the fish, this guy's toast. So it turns out the uh, the answer to that matchup is just win. That guy found a way to lose a 90-10 matchup. Yeah. I'd feel bad, but, like, I don't care. And uh, he sent one emote at me that I found personally offensive last game, so... Hey, the good news is that if he's in my opening hand, or if he's in my mulligan, I can't draw him, so that's good. The Blitz game would be perfect for those bathroom breaks at work? Exactly. Exactly. That would be ideal, in fact, for a little bit of toilet stone. 
We have turned our curse into our strength. None will survive. Leave the fish last lover. Alright, uh, now our dagger can kill an eel. Or he just coins a um, a Galaka crawler and we cry. Alright. I'm actually glad it wasn't the idiot totem here. Portal isn't even that great for him because we have just the thug attack. That's not good for him at all. I feel like he would have played the weapon if he had it, so we're probably not getting value off of this. Crackle for three. Never lucky. Next turn is Fungal Mancer, so I want to increase the probability of landing one. This deck needs a Nozdorm you. <laughs> uh, thank you for that resub with Twitch Prime Buffy. Welcome back. I know it's been more than four months, but uh, Twitch Prime does weird things, so thank you for that continued support. Welcome back to the Raffle Rabble. Let's get the Ravel 1HS spam into chat to uh, welcome back Buffy. So here we go. Hit here, make a decision. Easy decision. Yeah, we're in a pretty good spot. Like, Devolve isn't even that great with a, uh, with a under-cost 5 min. What? Bet guy has been reading way too much Reddit. Nazdurmu is a 9-mana 8-8. That's one more stat than Baku. Obviously, you can just switch them out for a direct upgrade. It's a good call.